Now let S be the set with the elements 1, 2, 3. In this tutorial, we are going to find the power set of S. And number 2, we are going to find the cardinality of uh, the power set of S. But when you are looking at uh, the power set of uh, any given set, it is uh, the set of all subsets of uh, that uh, given set. And we denote it by a P there. So in this case, we are looking at uh, the set of all subsets of uh, that given S there. And uh, to write uh, those uh, subsets of uh, S there, we we'll need to recall some uh, results. And the first one that I want to look at is uh, we should know that uh, the empty set is uh, a subset of uh, any given set. So in this case, uh, using the result from that theorem there, we will know that the empty set is a subset of uh, that uh, given uh, S. So therefore, uh, the empty set there is a subset. And then uh, we'll now go on and uh, look at uh, the other subsets, the other elements that are there. We have uh, the set of the element 1, and the set of the element 2, and the set of the element 3, and the set of the element 1 and 2, and the set of the element 1 and 3, and the set of the element 2 and 3. But we also need to look at another set, and uh, we will need to look at the result of a uh, theorem which states that any given set is a subset of itself. So in this case, uh, the given S there is a subset of itself. So we can write it in the power set there. So that's uh, another subset. So that's the power set of S there. So those are all the subsets of uh, the given uh, set S. We can uh, now move on to cardinality of uh, the power set. We are having the empty set there and then the set which is 1, the set which is 2, the set which is 3, the set which is 1 and 2, the set which is 1 and 3, the set which is 2 and 3, then the set S itself. And uh, those elements, when you count them, they are 8. So we have uh, the cardinality of the power set of S is uh, 8. But we can uh, find the cardinality of the power set of uh, S using another formula. We know that uh, the cardinality of the power set of S is equal to 2 to the power of the cardinality of uh, the set uh, S. In this case, our S there has three elements. Therefore, the cardinality of S there is a 3. And using that formula, we have uh, the cardinality of the power set of S is uh, 2 to the power 3. And uh, 2 to the power 3 there gives us an uh, 8. So what we are having there on that formula gave us uh, the result, which is the same as the one when we count uh, the elements are uh, 1 by 1. But if we are looking at uh, larger sets, it is better to use uh, that formula there, because in some cases counting them one by one might be a bit uh, difficult.